Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make a menu in Visual Basic 6. You need to open up Visual Basic 6 and use standard executional. Let's make the form a little bit bigger. And to make the menu, you need to click on Tools, then Menu Editor. In the caption, we, we could put File, Name, M and U for menu and then file. And then whenever you click on that, there'll be a drop down menu. And to make whatever drops down, you need to click next, then press the right arrow, and it'll add four little dots. And then you can type exit. And then the name and then M and U exit. Okay. Now when we click on file, it'll bring down the drop down menu and exit. When I click on that, it'll bring it up where I can put in code. And to exit the application, all we'll have to type in is end. And I will have the code for these things in the description. We can go back to the object. And to add a different little drop down box, we can go back to Tools, Menu Editor. Then click on Exit and press Next. And it'll add the four little dots again. But since you want to make a new menu, you'll press Left to get rid of those. In the caption we could do forms. And then you forms for the name. And then to make some drop down boxes from it, put next and then the right arrow. And this caption could be form two. And then you form two. And I'm only going to do one extra form on here, but you all can put as many as you would like. Okay, and I'm going to add a new form. And now here you can see over here I have two forms, but I want to go back to form one. In the code, like whenever I click on this form two after I put in the code, it'll take me to form two. So whenever I put it, click on that to put in the code, I will put form one dot hide form two dot show. Now go back to the form. Whenever I run this. Here's my menu. Everything could drop down. I'll just go file and then exit. And it terminates the application. Now we can try out going to form two. Forms, form two. So that takes you to the blank form that I made. But to show that it's actually doing that, I'll go to form two and put some command buttons just for looks. And I'll put in a little menu box here. And just put captions, forms, and then you forms for the name. And then next, and then br press right to bring out the four dots for the drop down menu. And type in form one. The name would be MNU form one. Now, when we click, click OK, we need to go here and add the code for this. And the code for this will be. Form two dot hide form one dot show. Now when we run this and we go to form two, here's the command buttons, they're not doing anything. But when you click on forms on form two, and click on form one, it'll take you back to the first one. And that's how you make a drop down menu box in Visual Basic 6. Thank you for watching my video.